So MetaMask have released a brand new application that you may not have heard about. So in this video, I'm gonna go through the application, how it works, and how this could be a trigger for the MetaMask airdrop. If you enjoy the content in this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel and also leave me a comment with some feedback down below. So MetaMask have released their first new product in a very, very long time. This is the Portfolio DAP, ingeniously named, which allows you to actually see your tokens across a lot of different chains all in one neat place. Think of it as the aggregator for your portfolio in one neat and tidy place. But more than just allowing you to see your tokens that you have, it also shows your non-fungible tokens as well. So let's take a look at this product. Now, MetaMask previously only has a few features. You can swap tokens within the application itself. You can also buy tokens directly. And there's also a gas optimization as well. So you can set the gas level that you require for your transaction. Used by many as just a wallet, but as you can see, they're building out more products and services to allow you to do a little bit extra, improving the overall user experience. MetaMask created by Consensus, one of their most key product lines, I would suggest, and the most well-known and most utilized. So this product has been added due to a load of community feedback that essentially MetaMask wasn't doing enough for consumers. So now they've actually brought this out and tried to enhance user experience and essentially ensure users can do a lot more in one place rather than having to go elsewhere. So Portfolio DAP is a beta release right now that we can get our hands on and start to play with. As they say, this is going to allow for a richer portfolio view, aggregating your assets across multiple different accounts and different networks. So they say that they've been listening to our feedback and instead of just allowing us to view our portfolios in one place, they've built us a full DAP instead. So within this, you can do a load of different things. Essentially, just read your wallet balances, track them, aggregate them, which allows you to understand exactly how much your portfolio is worth. So this product comes for mobile users and also extension users such as myself. And you can find it at portfolio.metamask.io. The address will be left for you down in the description. So if you just roll through here, you can add multiple accounts. They could be offline wallets, online wallets. They don't have to be MetaMask specific wallets. You can add them all in one place here, making it a very easy user experience. And what's more is you can track other wallets. So for example, something I like to do is track whale wallets and see what they're buying and selling as this can be a great market indicator. And this comes with multi-chain access. So this can read your wallets across Ethereum, Optimism, Binance's Smart Chain, Polygon, Phantom, Arbitrum and Avalanche. So not only can you see your tokens, but this is also providing a richer NFT experience as well. So you can view your NFTs within this application. So this is a real one-up. So rather than save yourself going to OpenSea all the time, logging into that, you can see all of your fungible tokens and non-fungible tokens through the MetaMask portfolio dApp in one simple place. So let's go and jump right on into it. So this is the website here, and you need to connect your wallet first and foremost. And once you connect your MetaMask wallet, it's gonna ask for some permission. So once you've logged in and you've clicked OK to connect your wallet, you can then start to see your portfolio breakdown. So this is one of my old wallets here. It's got quite a bit of phantom-based tokens within it and a current value of just 250 bucks. Now let's have a little look across the menu here. You can change your denominator from dollars to maybe yuan, euro, or even British pounds. You can see all the networks that are currently connected. You could deselect some if you don't wish to see all the balances across these. And you can of course add more portfolios and more wallets here as well, just by clicking this down tab here. Then over on the left hand side, this is currently on portfolio view, but we can add a watch list here. So if you wanna just track cryptocurrencies, for example, Ethereum, click it, add it as a favorite, and then you can just track the real-time data for this asset. So similar to what you have on maybe CoinGecko, for example, a nice terminal, but you've also got your holdings listed at the bottom as well. If we just go down here further as well, if you want nighttime or dark mode, you can do both of those easily. Now, all of this is tracking real-time data, your balance and dollar price for those relevant assets all connected here via an API. And you can see which asset makes up what percentage of your portfolio as well. This may be quite an interesting thing to use if you need to rebalance your portfolio at any time. Then towards the right, we have the NFT tab and you can see the various NFTs that you own. But what I'm likely to do with this is actually utilize the add another account button here to track 
hacks and whale wallets that I like to look for. Now, if for example, you know a popular influencer or whales wallet address via their ENS, you could simply add that, for example, vitalik.eth, import that wallet and then track their wallet as well. So a nice bump up in the net worth there, but let's just deselect my wallet via the deselect button up here. And now we're focused primarily here on Vitalik's wallet. So this is a good way to track whales, influencers, people who you think are a step ahead in the crypto game to give you maybe a bias on what assets you want to add. Now, as this is a brand new application, typically what we see is developers like to reward those early adopters. So I think that potentially the MetaMask airdrop, if it does come or when it does come, could have some linkage to this portfolio DAP that we have here. So simply just connecting up to this and starting to use it may get you on the list for the airdrop. Think about it, if you release a brand new product, you want to reward those with tokens who are actually utilizing it. And personally, my method with this has been to actually utilize all the features of MetaMask. I've ensured that I've swapped tokens within it itself, bought some Ethereum through it as well, and also changed my gas a few times, just to make sure we hit all those trigger points for the airdrop as and when it comes. Not financial advice, and of course this is not guaranteed, but in my mind this makes the most sense. So overall, I think this is a cool addition to MetaMask's offerings, and I think that this could be a development step for more to come. With multi-chain access and the ability to read across all your various portfolios, how long will it be before they start to offer us in-app services, maybe the ability to stake or multi-chain swap, borrow or lend? I think it does make sense they would start to incorporate a load more features, as why the heck do we always need to leave these decentralized applications and go to other ones when we could have one super app? And I think this is how MetaMask will approach it. So let me know down below what do you think of this portfolio tracker? Could this be the gateway to a MetaMask airdrop? And will you actually use this? Drop me a comment down below, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.